Today we're going to talk about indicators of lameness in dairy cows. Lameness is a major issue for Australian dairy farmers. Lame cows produce less milk, lose weight and take longer to cycle. Lame cows are a welfare issue and should be treated as soon as they are identified. The Dairy Australia Healthy Hooves Lameness Score is a reliable approach to identifying cows likely to benefit from treatment. It has been developed using combined knowledge from the UK, US and New Zealand scoring systems and adapted to the Australian industry. Our scoring system is a four point scoring system from no lameness that is a score of zero through to a severe lameness score of three and links to the action required for managing each group. It is helpful to observe cows standing behind them or from the side as they walk. Cows have evolved to avoid being targeted by predators and are extremely good at hiding the signs of pain associated with lameness. Cows showing early signs of lameness can be found throughout the herd as they try to maintain their normal position walking to the dairy. As their lameness worsens, they may be found towards the back of the herd. Dairy Australia's lameness scoring focuses on six areas of a cow's mobility that will indicate whether she is lame and how severely. These are walking speed, walking rhythm, stride length and foot placement, weight bearing, back alignment and head position. Firstly, let's look at walking speed. Cows will normally walk at a similar speed to a person and will maintain her position in the herd. As her condition worsens, her walking speed will slow and she may move to the back of the herd as she struggles to keep up. This is most noticeable after milking when cows are walking at their own pace back to the paddock. Another indicator is walking rhythm. Cows normally have a regular rhythm with all four legs and walk confidently with a fluid motion. If she becomes lame, the rhythm will be interrupted and become uneven. Often the non-lame front or hind leg will swing through quicker to reduce the time on which the lame leg bears weight. A cow's stride length and foot placement are excellent indicators for lameness score. When cows walk on an even surface and at their own pace, they will track up. They look in front of them for each step and choose where their front feet land. Then their back feet will land in exactly the same spot. This allows them to place their feet safely and avoid obstacles such as stones. Cows with lameness scores of one, two and three may have a shortened stride and their rear foot may fall short of their front foot placement. Another indicator is how a cow bears weight on all four limbs. Cows with healthy feet place and bear weight evenly on all four legs while standing and walking. Lame cows will favour the lame leg. This leg will not fully weight bear and the opposite leg will take more weight and the dew claw will sink closer to ground level. How straight and even a cow's back is can also indicate her lameness score. Non-lame cows tend to stand and walk with a straight back, whereas an arch back can indicate lameness. That said, an arch back can also be a sign of an uncomfortable walking surface or other health issues such as gut pain. A cow's head position and movement is another indicator to lameness. A cow will normally hold her head slightly below the back line. When she is walking, the head only moves a little. A cow carries 60% of her weight in the front half. She can use her head position to transfer weight away from a painful leg. She will raise her head to take weight off a lame front foot and lower her head to take weight off a lame back foot. This can be seen as a bobbing head when walking. Many of the early indicators of lameness are subtle and only seen with careful inspection of walking cows. Yet early treatment is the key to rapid and complete recovery 
with minimal disturbance to the cow and her productivity. For more information on the Healthy Hooves project, you should visit the Dairy Australia website.